Okay, everybody. Hello, and welcome to another video. So this is just going to be a quick video showing everybody how to uh, take off the disk drive side plate on the PS5 Pro and then installing a disk drive. So first off, as you can see, I have the PlayStation 5 Pro laying um, bottom side up right now. So this is like the little uh, PlayStation symbol foot. And then also I had it in the vertical orientation. So I had the original legs um, installed. So I'll get back to these later, but for now I will remove them because I'm going to be taking off this plate. So I'll just take those off first. Uh, if you have those installed, also do this as a first step so that you don't damage anything on the console. Okay, so again with the PS5 Pro bottom side up, you want to uh, detach the larger side uh, because that's where the disk drive installs. If you're also going to be installing an SSD or you're just doing that at a different time, that's going to be on the smaller side of the bottom of the console. Uh, it's going to be right around here. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and detach this uh, side of the console. That's going to be pretty easy. You want to make sure you're only pulling from the front side of the console. So the front is actually facing away from me right now. And you want that for yourself as well. The clips on the front side are what actually connect and detach. The ones on the back side, I've seen some people pull up from here. Do not do that because you can risk breaking those clips and then this cover won't sit flush. Um, either you'll break uh, the connector points on the PlayStation 5 side or you'll break them on the actual cover side and it just won't connect properly. So again, only pull up from the front side of the console here. Okay, so with the uh, front facing away from me, I'm going to brace uh, my thumb on this area of the console right here and then grab up from here. I'm just going to do a direct uh, upwards pull. So it's good. if this is the first time you're doing it, it's also going to be a little bit more difficult. So don't worry. You just want to do a direct upwards pull. I'm going to do that now. There we go. We have one solid clip here and then I'm going to do it for the rest. There you go. So that's it. I think there's three or four clips here on this side. As you can see, uh, let me flip it over right here. This is the front side of the console. These are the actual clips that click into these uh, holes right here. And then the back side, as you can see, are these hooks. So again, do not pull up from the back side because you could risk damaging these hooks. And once these hooks are gone, uh, then this won't uh, close properly. Okay, so as you can see here, this is where the disk drive will live. That is the connector side. Then there's going to be a hole right up here for a peg to, uh, or a guiding pin to actually uh, guide the connector properly for, so it's seated. Also to note, you see these triangles right here with uh, denoting these uh, rectangular holes. This is where the hooks of the disk drive are going to go in, and I'm going to pull that out right now. So here is the disk drive. These are the hooks. They have a rubberized feet right here, so you don't have to really worry about breaking anything. But this is what you're going to want to install first. So doing that, let's install the uh, legs on these hooks here, just like so. And then you want to gently lower it down, just like this. As you can see, the connector side is going in. Once it's in, once you feel that it's seated, you just do a light push down here where you see this other uh, triangle area. So, oops, make sure that's seated. And then one, two, three, there you go. A nice solid click. And then if you actually want to, uh, uh, what is it, take this out, take the disk drive out, you want to pull up directly upwards from this area right here underneath this uh, triangle, triangular um, symbol. Okay, so now that the disk drive is installed, we're going to be installing the disk drive uh, cover here. So this is what comes with the disk drive when you purchase it new. Uh, as you can see, this one only has two hooks on the back side. So these are gonna line up with the back part of the console here. So I'm going to be doing that right now. You wanna install the back side first. So something like this, I guess. You wanna get some make sure it's covering the disk drive then has a good amount of movement this is what it looks like currently uh, i have not clicked it down yet so um now you just want to do a opposite motion as before you're just going to want to be pushing down directly from the front so i'm going to be doing that now solid click there another lighter click on the bottom side and uh that's it so that is the disk drive installed okay so something else to note is if you're using the ps5 pro in the vertical uh, orientation then you don't have to worry about installing these legs here however you will have to remove that circular plastic bit right there so that the base can screw into the bottom of the console um, but if you're going to be using in the horizontal position like I will be 
you must install the legs, these larger ones that came with the actual disk drive because the ones that came with the PS5 Pro are too short. Um, so yeah, you have to make sure to use these legs in specific that come with the disk drive. And that's pretty much it. So um, thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you'd like to see similar videos and goodbye.